Well, this has been a big conversation today. Security is top of mind for the North Carolina Central University community tonight. This after this, thousands were on campus to celebrate homecoming this weekend when two unrelated shootings nearby halted festivities. Four people, including one student, are recovering from gunshot wounds. WRL's Laura Levine asked the university about its safety protocols and the next steps. A calm, quiet, and gloomy day follows a very eventful homecoming week for NC Central. Just, you know, really just physically exhausted and tired just by all the events. I caught up with students trying to regroup as the remnants of the party remain. Anaya Noel was out here last night when the celebration abruptly took a turn. I was scared because I'm like, oh my gosh, there could be a possible shooter close to us and you never know what can happen. Around 745 is when the first alert of an active shooter went out. Police determined three shots were fired in the air and no one was harmed. I was also holding holding the door open for anyone that didn't have access to my residence hall for them to get inside and hide. And just before nine o'clock, a second active shooter alert was sent out to the community. Police say four people have non-life threatening gunshot wounds, including one student. My friends, they also witnessed one of the girls on camp getting hurt. So it was really, it's really a sad experience. I reached out to the university for an interview asking them about safety protocols. Less than an hour later, the university shared this statement with the public. NCCU prepared and executed a comprehensive security protocol in preparation for the celebration of homecoming on Saturday. Despite this extensive preparation, it is not possible to entirely prevent random acts of violence. They also said there are nearly 2,000 security cameras monitored throughout the campus. And NCCU police had over 100 officers from multiple agencies on campus Saturday. Because this is an open campus, so things that go around the campus and near the campus is like very like much of a concern to us because they can come on school grounds and anybody can get hurt. We can't let that from stopping the next homecoming or the homecoming after that, you know, we just got to regroup and then think about what we can do better next year. Laura Levine, WREL News in Durham. We do want to let you know that police did take a suspect into custody for the first shooting. We are working to learn if there are any arrests made in these cases. The university's policy on firearms is on its website. It reads in part, it is a violation of state criminal law and university policy to possess or carry any weapon as defined below on the campus of North Carolina Central University, except as otherwise specifically provided by law. This regulation applies to all faculty, staff, and students, as well as visitors to the campus. Violators of this regulation will be referred for criminal prosecution. In addition, any faculty, staff, or student who violate this regulation may also be subject to disciplinary action.